Hello guys, Sir Grindelot here. I'm sorry, I failed you. I started to play an archer. <laughs> I've completed my mage. I was not planning to, to play an archer at all. I, I know it looks like a mage, but this is an archer, trust me. Uh, but I purchased everything that I could ever wish to purchase on the mage with the Australian wheel. And I have all the drops possible <laughs> for a mage. Uh, apart from an astral diamond headman, more on this later. So I decided, you know, I'm 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 a bit done with this character. <laughs> it has everything that I could get for it. How about I use a different one? <laughs> so I started to level up and use the archer for grinding. It has the gear of a mage. I simply transferred it to this one as soon as it reads the reincarnation six. And uh, yeah, I'm basically only looking for an astral version of the new Ballista, which I find fun. I would be happy to use it, which is the main reason why I'm, I'm, I'm currently leveling up uh, an, an Archer and looking for drops for this class. And I'm still looking for a Diamond Headband in astral form, because the game decided to give me a helmet of, with that skin. And when I opened the backpack, it was tier 6, and I got super excited, and it was a circlet. And I was no longer excited. So, yeah, that, that was not a great start of the week. It happened this morning. Uh, I'm recording this on Monday, and uh, the tier 6 astral circlet happened this morning. It's no longer in my possession, of course. It, <laughs> it became a Cabalite extremely quickly. I'm now starting to leave a lot of drops on the ground because I have more than uh, uh, 1,000 Cabalites in the bank. I will I will never need uh, that many. And I even did a few Forgotten Realm uh, runs just, you know, to change the pace a bit. Uh, on the Archer, not only is it not level 1,500 yet, uh, but it does not have uh, uh, any of the Australian wheels designed for swords yet. Uh, which means my Astral Sword at the moment is a bit trashy <laughs> compared to a Demon Bone or an Ember or anything like that. But, but I need to stick with it. Um, considering how fast it is to make Essence Points in this map, uh, uh, I'm thinking to really, really level it as a mage uh, <laughs> like the whole time and get the Australian wheels for the magical damage and skill bonus for swords and then just keep grinding with this one, you know, to have a, a nicer stock of uh, the new items, hopefully finding the diamond headband as well and some extra dragon slayer bows and I think by the time I will have enough Australian points to purchase the things that are <laughs> more fit for an archer rather than a mage. Uh, I would really like to try that new weapon, even if I have no idea how to spec the character. My, my experience with, ar with archer is what you see here, basically. Uh, I tried to play it a bit with uh, multi-shot, but eventually I always ended up uh, specking it as a mage, uh, magic orbit, multi-missile, and power weapon, and if I want to run around to put uh, corp Corpse Explosion instead of Multi-Missile, but it's way too early for that. Uh, my Magic Orbit here is hitting for 1 billion, and just Magic Orbit takes too long to kill stuff. That's why I need to... what's that? Hmm? Amulet? Let's pick it up. Uh, just, yeah, just Magic Orbit things are way too slow for my liking. So, I'm back to the teleport, multi-missile, teleport, multi-missile, teleport, which is still okay. It's still okay. And my head was starting to spin <laughs> uh, using the previous spec from my mage, uh, uh, where the only thing that I can do is press teleport <laughs> non-stop. Oh, hold on a moment. I need to turn off notification on my phone. Because horrible thing before horrible things start to happen. Okay, we're back. Uh, the reason is that I'm home from work, which is usually the time when 
workmates or um, clients or whoever start to think, hey, hey, Sir Grindelot, they all call me Sir Grindelot, of course. Uh, Sir Grindelot, th this problem happened. Can you fix it now that you're home and you're having some rest and you are recording a video for YouTube? I'm <laughs> like, of course not, fuck off. Um, but, so let, let's try to avoid that kind of scenario. scenario. Oh, and something amazing happened on YouTube today. I, I need to reply to the comment. Someone said that I, that I sound like a Dracula. <laughs> I don't even know what it means. <laughs> what kind of voice does Dracula have? <laughs> I've never heard him speak. But I like the comment so much. And it reminded me that people, according to my accent, guessed that I'm either Russian, Polish, uh, Dracula... <laughs> Wait, what was what else was there? Italian, or there was another one? Maybe Romania or Bulgaria, which is interesting to me. Like everyone is guessing, mostly Eastern Europe. Very very interesting. Like no one has even tried to move away from Europe, like Northern America, Central America. Uh, well, Russia technically is in Europe and it's also not, so it's a bit difficult, but. Uh, like Africa, Asia, no, no, none of those has ever been mentioned. It's always some East, m mainly Eastern European accent or Russian, if you consider that part of East Europe. Very, very interesting. I think that instead of trying, because okay, talking about Twitch for a moment, it's very difficult for me to set up a camera while I stream uh, because of the way I play. I play with my phone mainly while, while I stay on the couch. I know that a lot of streamers have like a gaming chair and then they stay bent all forward while they play with their phone or the tablet. But I find that extremely uncomfortable. So I, I comfortably play on the couch with the microphone slightly raised in front of me <laughs> and the laptop on the table next to me. And so not only is it a bit difficult to set up a webcam in that position, but it's also very odd because you would see someone laying on a couch and playing. So I haven't looked too much into how to find a, a, a reasonable way to set up a webcam for my Twitch streams. But now I started to think that if I actually set up the webcam, people will have a better idea of my rough geographic location, at least in terms of continent. And I, I find it more fun that people are <laughs> are throwing away like are throwing guesses like Russian or Dracula so I think I will never set up a webcam at least for the time being I will not do it just because I have too much fun seeing what kind of accent uh, people will come up with today so um, I have not started streaming yet uh, after my sore throat uh, I I think I've recovered completely now. <laughs> no, this one was fake, I made it up. Um, but I'm having a very busy week. Uh, I would like to try to do it Friday, but uh, since it's a very, very wild guess, uh, I don't want to say that I will be streaming Friday and then I'm missing in action. Uh, I think that when I'm back to a more reasonable, uh, with a reasonable workload, uh, I would like to set up one day for like a regular weekly stream uh, which will be probably mostly anima uh, for the time being but eventually it will be Diablo mobile eternal immortal whatever it is and possibly our games and probably on Monday uh, Monday is the day where I usually have more time and it's also perfect because everyone on Monday tends to have blue balls so that's why it's called the blue Monday and I think most streamers try to do it on weekends because that's when people are home. But my weekends are extremely busy. So <laughs> it's not really an option for me. On the other hand, Mondays are usually the least busy day for me. Meaning that if you're having a rough day on Monday, at least you will be able to open Twitch and there will be Sir Grind a lot with some horny birds. Uh, copulating in the background and playing some games. It can be fun. Uh, today I'm recording this on Monday, so uh, uh, no, I will not be doing it today. Possibly next week, but again, I, I will uh, make a video announcement here on YouTube to let everyone know 
when I have a more regular Twitch schedule, because previously all my streams were a bit like, oh, I have a couple of hours, let's stream, or I have five hours, let's stream. But I think that it will be much better for everyone, both for me and for my viewers, if I have a regular schedule. We shall see. Hopefully it will be Monday, uh, but still a bit early for that. Here in Anima, uh, I, I would say that I'm waiting for the Necromancer to be released, but, but more than that, I would like to know when the bloody season will end and how it will work, what will happen. <laughs> because so far it's all like people guessing well in other games uh, seasonal characters do this so we are guessing that in anime it will be the same but <laughs> I'm not a huge fan of the kind of guessing because like, <laughs> I would assume that the items in the bank get deleted because you cannot transfer them um, in the bank from the regular characters because you can only have one bank at a time uh, and the items in the backpack will stay this, uh, on your character. And that's fair enough. Like I take that as a correct assumption. But when will this happen? Because if I wake up one day and without any announcement, the devs are like, oh, oh guys, surprise, the season is over. You were not expecting that, right? <laughs> you might have missed a lot of items in the process because they've all been deleted. But fear not. The second season is right behind the corner, and there will be the Necromancer. I will give them the mightiest of the middle fingers, I will remove the app from my phone, <laughs> and delete all the saved data on Google Play, and I will make sure that any, every time that someone asks, hey guys, what's Anima? I will tell them it's the worst thing that has ever happened to humankind since syphilis. Please, don't do it, devs. Don't do something like that. And I don't understand why we're keeping it a secret. I, I was checking it uh, earlier today while I was on the toilet. Because, you know, like most people, I need to take a toilet break every now and then. And sometimes it's the kind of break for which you need to sit. You don't stand up. As I was, I was there, sitting, doing... A, let's say that I was preparing a chocolate cake. And I was playing Anim, of course. And time was passing by, and it was like five or six minutes, something like that. And I started to think, I can understand that the devs are very busy because it's only a three-man team. But I am also sure that a few times a week, I would say at least a couple of times a week, at least one of them needs to go to the toilet to prepare a chocolate cake. How difficult is it, while you are sitting on the toilet, to grab your phone and you go on your own forum that you created for your vi for the video game that you realized and you write a post or on Instagram, they also have Instagram and, uh, and Facebook but when they write something on Instagram they don't share it on Facebook I don't know how, I don't know why, but that's how they do it and you just, you know, open and, and, and the keyboard appears at the bottom and you say, guys, the season will finish on the 26th of March 2021. And at the end of the season, the items in your bank will be deleted. The items on your characters will move uh, with your character, which will become a regular character. And the second season will start immediately and there will be the Necromancer. Like, saying it took me, I don't know. 20 seconds, 30 seconds, I have no idea how long it took. How long would it take to write it? In English. Uh, let's assume, I think the team is, is Italian, I believe. Someone on the forum mentioned it's an Italian team. Let's say that you need to write it in Italian and then use Google Translate to translate it in English. But you want to double check if there are some mistakes. So maybe it takes you an extra couple of minutes. We're talking about three minutes on the toilet while making a chocolate cake that they could use to write an announcement to let the thousands of people who play this game what's going on with the game. I think it would be a great idea, don't you guys agree? <laughs> they're they're really, really lacking some communication skills. Unless their Twitter account was banned because they liked a post by Trump 
and so their whole account was banned and sent into the shadow realm because they're neo-nazis or something like that i'm not sure what's going on with twitter i don't use it so but that's mostly what i understood uh by by reading news of the recent days but yeah guys that you have, you have three people i think that combined the three of you at least four times a week uh, have to make a chocolate cake in the toilet so grab a phone or a tablet or bring your laptop Do don't tell me that even during your toilet breaks you need to bring the laptop with you to code because you have a small team and yada yada, yada. don't i don't believe it i refuse to believe it you are not coding for anima while you're dropping a turd in the toilet look and it's a tier five it's a dr there on the ground I, I don't even want to bring it with me I refuse to bring it with me. That's it. Oh, oh Sir Grindelot will, will then check out and go back to pick it up. No, there, reset. I refuse to bring with me a tier 5 Dragon Slayer. Absolutely refuse. I'm done with, with tier 5 trash. First the tier 6 Astral Circlet. Now I get a Dragon Slayer and it's tier 5. Now we we'll get a tier 6 White Wing. And then I will get triggered behind the human capacity i'm not having a great time <laughs> with the game at the moment no no I'm, I'm having fun i'm enjoying it it's just that um what did i get the last few days before i started playing archer i got uh, an astral tier 6 demon bone which is nice and then i got an astral tier 5 demon bone which is not very nice but you know if i find another tier 5 astral sword I can infuse it with a tier 5 astral demon bone and it will be a, a small improvement but it's really really minor stuff and i want tier 6 dragon slayer do you remember when some time ago i told you oh i have a lot of tier 5 gear so if i drop tier 5 dragon slayers it's okay i'm i'm beyond that point <laughs> like i don't care about tier 5 gear any longer i moved to tier 6 so i don't even want to check what's this bag is full it could be maybe it's a dragon slayer i'm not sure no i think it's it's the skin of the uh, bows like the zephyr but we will go to check it out let's recycle this mountain of garbage i got so many trinities I, like every time it's a trinity why bloodstorm yeah i i think that the um, the bow on the ground had that skin, but I'm not a hundred percent sure. We shall see. There, there. Oh, if you're a bit confused about the top right corner, it says Reincarnation 6. Uh, because I didn't finish all the Reincarnation from 1 to... What is it? 10. Yes. <laughs> I did not finish all the reincarnation from 1 to 10. Yeah, it's the wrong one. Um, once I reached the reincarnation 6, uh, I started to clear the new zone in order to reach the Magician's Tower. And then I've been farming here uh, for some time now. Not a, a huge amount of time, just a few hours. Uh, probably t less than 10 hours, I would say. How's the Australian situation right now? Uh, we complete this one before moving on. Yeah, sounds about right. Okay. Oh my god, I need to open my computer give me a second guys give me a second it's a disaster if i don't open the computer oh my god i have 25 million messages oh my god it's over okay we're back it, it was indeed a notification that i needed to <laughs> but i saw it on the computer and i needed to reply to it it happens unfortunately it happens every now and then uh, which is why <laughs> very often for me, streaming on Twitch while I'm playing on the phone can be a bit troublesome and there is no way I will be able to do it many times a week. I will be very happy if I can set one day during which I'm like, I'm, I'm sorry guys, I'm in the hospital, I have COVID and 
you cannot reach me, it's over, it's over. And then the following week, same thing, same day. And then, and then let's see how long it lasts, I don't know. Oh, miss the floors. It's okay. Uh, I, I think I got a lot of drops there. Were they all trash? Yes. Feels bad, man. <laughs> Feels uber bad, man. Uh, unfortunately, today I don't have a lot of time to play uh, and to record this video because uh, I will very soon need to start preparing dinner for my hungry, hungry daughter who is one year and a half and eats like a six-year-old guy. Uh, <laughs> but, you know, she's growing well, so... We, we let her handle her, her own metabolism for the time being. <laughs> Sometimes the amount of food she has is a bit scary, but the doctor says she's doing great and she, she looks great, so... We're okay if she eats a bit more than they expected. But it means that I need to start preparing food uh, in advance. I think that I will finish this floor... Then I will call it a day for my recordings. Hopefully Audacity didn't screw me completely because I forgot to check Audacity while I was recording. And so, yeah, to recap, uh, I started playing Archer because I want uh, Dragon Slayer bows and some extra copies of the new Ballista. <laughs> and I don't know if I will do the same with the Warrior. I, I cannot ex exclude it because a proper fra farming endlessly and just looking for uh, what are they called diamond headbands i don't really have a purpose for the game right now oh my god missed the too many floor i don't really have a purpose in the game uh, right now so try to keep myself slightly entertained by doing different things uh, for the warrior the the one-handed sword with the six slots, I already have it. Uh, I could infuse it with a whatever and start spinning, which is okay. Warrior is pretty good at farming. Pretty, pretty good at farming. Other than that, I don't know. I, I would mostly wait for any update by the devs, just to have an idea of how long this bloody season will go on and what will happen after this and when they will release the necromancer like there are so many things we we should be able to know like we should be informed about those things why are they keeping them a secret like what's the purpose is it extra fun do you find it fun guys not knowing i think that not knowing is not very fun <laughs> like i'm not having a great time Every time that I, uh, like when I go to sleep and I think, hmm, will I wake up with a new patch tomorrow <laughs> and everything I have in the back is deleted? <laughs> it's not a great time. So please, devs, I I'm pretty sure you're not watching the video, <laughs> but hopefully, <laughs> the, like the positive uh, vibrations the cosmic vibrations or whatever of this video will reach you and be translated in whatever language you speak and you will think, you know what? I should go to the toilet to release something and as I do so, I will bring my phone and I will update Instagram letting everyone know what's the deal with the season and with the necromancer and everything else hopefully but, you know, there is also the chance that the devs just want to play Diablo Immortal, or whatever it's called. And, and they're like, you know what, the season will be over uh, like the day Diablo Immortal comes out, and the game will stop being developed, and the devs will be just gone, and they will use the money they made uh, from this game to purchase uh, crests in Diablo Immortal. It, it's a possibility. It could happen, I mean... <laughs> They didn't tell us anything, so how are we supposed to know the truth? We can only guess. My guess is as good as yours. So, we shall see. I wonder if I went to kill Kral with this character. Will I have two characters in the leaderboard? How does it work? <laughs> yeah, no, but missing all the skill, uh, the Australian things uh, 
for the swords and the extra intellect at the end. I'm below 100 million DPS. No, it would take me forever. Forever. Okay, I reached the end of the four. I don't have any extra experience bonus, so I think we're done. This is a grind a lot checking out. Hopefully I will have a bit more time tomorrow to do a longer grinding session. In the meantime, I'm wishing you all a happy grinding, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, take care.